Keith Dubberly. I'm a youth pastor here at Eastside Baptist Church. And I would like to take just a few moments to tell you about the student ministry that we have in place currently here at our church. We, uh, we minister to students from the 6th grade up to the 12th grade. And we primarily have two things that happen during the course of every week of the year that we use to try to reach out to and help grow students in a relationship closer to God. The first thing is our Sunday School program. If you'll watch the education ministry video here on this DV, you'll hear uh, this DVD, you'll hear a word about our education ministry. But what takes place is every Sunday morning from roughly 9.30 a.m. to 10.30 a.m., we break up our students uh, in several different classes. We have a sixth grade class, a seventh grade class, an eighth grade class, and we have a ninth and tenth grade class that's combined as well as an eleventh and twelfth grade class that's combined. Each class has its own set of teachers and they cover um, issues that are very pertinent and relevant to our young people's lives these days. The sixth through the eighth graders are on a track to where through a two-year period they cover the entire scriptures from the book of Genesis to the book of Revelation. Our high schoolers are using the material currently that teaches them the theology of the Christian faith. We cover issues such as the Bible, why we should believe it, how it came to be a book consisting of 66 books, and so on and so forth. It's been a great thing for our young people. That is our Sunday school program. On Wednesday nights is our second main thing that we use to try to reach out to young people. We have a big service from 6 o'clock p.m. to 8 o'clock p.m. every Wednesday night. We have pool tables, ping pong tables, a cafe where they can buy drinks and snacks, and we give them a solid 45 minutes or so just to hang out, to spend some time relaxing with their friends outside of the stress of school, outside of the stress of extracurricular activities, and uh, they can get to know each other better. And then we all come together, we play some group games to build you know, team building skills, leadership skills to help the kids get to know each other, fellowship better. Uh, we have a time of worship where a praise band led by our own students plays and leads us in song. And then I will preach a sermon. Uh, currently I'm going through a series called Student Struggles where we deal with issues like identity, acceptance, purity, dating, divorce, racism. We cover all these issues and more. I want to encourage you to uh, let your young people be a part of this dynamic ministry where we can help them, by God's grace, grow closer to God. Thank you.